Welcome to Project Tombard, guys. We were going to be playing Cepheus Protocol today, but uh, the new uh, Unreal Engine Update 5 is out, and apparently it's wonderful, and uh, the devs are updating the game to use that engine, and uh, I want to wait until that's done so that we don't get interrupted by an engine update and stuff like that. So we're going to do that after Project Tomboid. Uh, which is a fantastic game. Uh, if you don't know Project Zomboid, you are missing out. It is probably the best uh, zombie survival game out there. And it's quite old. I think it's from, what, 2013 or something. I don't know exactly. But it is quite old, but it is quite amazing as well. We're going to play Flow Solo. We're going to play Survivor. And we're going to choose some mods, so let me just choose those, and then I'll be back. Okay, here's the mod list. Uh, Authentic Sea, Authentic Sea Backpacks, Autosod Trailers, Autosod Tuning, uh, Crash Cars, uh, Extra Map Symbols, Extra Map Symbols UI, Filibuster Rhymes Used Cars, Filibuster Rhymes Used Cars, uh, this is for lore-friendly names. Uh, we are going to be playing with the Map Legend UI, and the Mod Manager is on, uh, Paper Women's uh, Sleeping Bags, uh, Primitive Survival, Raven Creek, Scrap Armor, Scrap Guns, and Scrap Weapons, uh, the Workshop, which is required for those three, True Actions, which allows us to uh, sit on couches and stuff like that, which is kind of nice because in the base game you can't sit on a couch. You always sit on the floor, but with that, we can. Uh, the common library, for SAR's common library, which is used for the SAR things, uh, auto SAR stuff. And uh, then we'll have Vanilla Firearms expansion and West Point expansion. Oh, and Raven Creek. I don't think I mentioned Raven Creek. So those are the ones we're going to use. The game just needs a minute to uh, update uh, everything, and then we'll be back. Uh, we're going to be playing on survivor mode next we'll start in rosewood i think mm -hmm. uh, we did put in raven creek and uh, west Point expansion but we're going to start in rosewood and i am amazing at this game i have survived at least seven days i'd say uh, so i am absolutely a pro uh, let's just call this uh yup tub and continue on uh, so we are going to have some traits so you can have positive traits and negative traits uh, you have eight points to spend uh, by default to choose something positive and then you can if you choose something negative like uh, uh, let's see uh, conspicuous if you add that then you get more points uh, uh, to use for the positive stuff but i have uh, pre-saved a setup and we are going to be a chubby smoker because that's me I am well erotically chubby and uh, and I am a smoker mm -hmm. so uh, we're going to be overweight uh, smoker we'll have cat's eyes for better vision at night uh, we'll be a fast reader takes less time to read books uh, books are read to uh, update your skills so you can bet get better at carpentry, cooking, all kinds of things. Inconspicuous, less likely to be spotted by zombies. We're lucky, sometimes things just go your way. And we have keen hearing, a larger perception radius. Okay. And I also have a character, uh, me, Martin Nilsson. That's what I look like, though my hair is way cooler. And uh, it is, well, some people might say that it's gray, but I'm sticking with blonde uh, so that's me and let's go ahead and play so in this game <laughs> there's no surviving I mean you, you you'll never survive forever I mean maybe you can but uh, I really doubt it I really doubt it uh, we we have turned off that uh, zombies respawn we have turned off that um, uh, what's it called uh, loot response and stuff like that so 
there is a finite amount of stuff on the map so if you survive long enough then you'll run out of stuff but you can craft you can uh, you can scavenge stuff like that so uh, you can farm so you theoretically could survive forever but it's very unlikely because one bite and you're dead i mean one bite uh, there's no getting around it if you get bitten you're dead uh, i have set, made the settings so that uh, if you get scratched uh, well you, you can die from it uh, but i've set it up so that if i get scratched and i get infected from that scratch i die immediately so that we don't wait around to see if we die let's start Okay, don't care about all that. And where are we? Okay, we're... Take a look at the map. We're here. So, that doesn't tell us much. We know that we're in Rosewood. But other than that, I really have no idea where we are. Let's see. Ooh, there's a radio. Let's equip that secondary. We want to see if it has some stuff that we want we want that magazine or we want to see if it has the challenge uh, channel that we want it does not so we're going to leave that behind so there is an emergency broadcast channel which will tell you if a helicopter is coming and helicopters are bad because they give away your position and um zombies will come gathering around and, and that that is not a good thing uh, all right, let's check out the kitchen. We have a can opener. That's good. We have some spaghetti bolognese. We'll take that. Uh, we have a bowl, which I'll take. Uh, a water bottle. Oh, nice. And that's about it here. Let's just see. Oh, a frying pan. We have a weapon. We have a weapon. That's very good. Uh, ooh, some fresh foods. We'll take an apple, some cheese, uh, some carrots, I guess. Uh, doesn't really matter if there's frozen stuff because we can't carry that much around. So we have a carry capacity of 12 right now, and we've already used 4.69 of it, which is a lot. Uh, a sheet is always a good thing to grab. We'll grab that. Oh, we want to turn on the TV. Turn it way down, and we want to go to Life and Living TV. Am I too late? I don't know, because we don't have a watch yet. Uh, the intermediate books we don't really care about. Um, yeah, there's nothing there. You don't want to get overloaded uh, early on. Just be picky on what you uh, decide to, to bring with you. Uh, we can rip some clothing. Uh, because we want some bandages. So... Uh, actually, let's rip that. And we'll get some bandages. There's another radio there. Let's see if it has the broadcast, uh, the emergency channel. No, it does not. In that case, we'll just leave it B. And I guess we'll move on. Uh, there's a zombie out there. All right, first zombie we meet. Scary stuff. Okay. Now... Some zombies go down quick, sometimes zombies go down hard. Uh, but I think you don't have anything that I really want. Okay, let's see. There's a zombie down there, zombie down there. There, There is a shed back here that I want to take a look at. Uh, it's locked. Right, let's try the window. Nice, and no alarm, which is even nicer. Scrap metal wire. Ooh, a hammer. An attach belt uh, left, and a screwdriver. 
attach belt. Right, these are good finds. And a ball bean hammer, which will take us well, I guess. Uh, we would like the rake and stuff as well, but not right now. Okay. But these were good finds. These were good finds. Now, this is a two-story house. Which is something that we are very interested in. So let's see if we can get in here. This two-story house is a potential new home for us. There's a zombie in here. I want to close this door. Let's just come up behind you. Oh, he turned around. Ah! Uh, there. Right, let's stomp him. Okay. Well, a classic rich swatch is better than no watch. So let's put that on the left wrist. We'll grab the house key as well. Don't want the jacket, it's too hot, even though it gives more protection. And we're going to search the house before we do anything else, because always finish searching somewhere before you start looting it. That's just good practice. Uh, we'll close these curtains. We want to curtain this up completely. This could be a good starting base. The house next door is burned down, but we don't really care about that. Um, is the music a little bit too loud? The music might be a little bit too loud. Uh, I'll check that in between episodes and see if we need to turn it down. I think we do. Alright, so the house is cleared. I do hear a zombie somewhere. A sheet of paper, an empty notebook. I think. Crossword magazine. Oh, a uh, red pen. We want a pen. So this could be a, a decent place to start. Nothing interesting in there. We can grab, a, grab something to drink. Uh, uh, no, we don't want to fill the empty bowl. What's in here? We can close these curtains. Do that immediately. And see what's in here. Uh, sleeping tablets, not bad. Crossword magazine and a magazine. Good for boredom. Denim jeans, okay. Let's check over here. There's in there as well good nothing in there almost 12 o'clock so we have a tv show coming up that we want to watch um we do have a tv uh, let's add this sheet here oh we can't get in there we have to take that apart where is this zombie that i can hear um let's add a sheet there close the curtains all right, we need to turn on the TV. Uh, Last options. Turn on, turn it way down. And put it on life and living TV. Our thing here is kind of in the way. Put it over there. Hey. You hear that, zombie? Don't like the sound of that. We have curtains here as well. Let's close them. Hey, okay. did we tune in? No, we didn't. Okay, there we go. All right. So this is a cooking show, I think. But I think we missed it. Or is it 12.30 it starts? It might be. Let's just see. Okay, so Dean saucepan. We don't really need to be carrying around our canned spaghetti anymore. Come on. Canned spaghetti. Get over there. What else do we have? 
Nothing much. Beer bottle mayonnaise. Some frozen stuff. That's nice. Okay. Oh, there's a door here. I don't think I've checked that door. Oh. Uh, let's see. Mop, rich sheets. And a sponge. Okay. All right, let's turn the TV off. So, uh, if we take a look at skills, we have a bunch of skills here. So, sprinting, light footed, nimble, sneaking, combat skills, crafting skills, firearm skills, and survivalist skills. These are all skills that we want to um, that we want to uh, level up. Uh, so we don't have a whole lot in this house. Uh, what we will do is go check. I don't see any zombies around here. Uh, let's see. We can open this garage. We can. Let's close the window again. What's in here? Nail gun magazine, box of nails, very nice. Box of screws, planks, cordless grill, screwdriver wrench, an empty gas can, wonderful. Uh, scarf, it's not that great. Uh, but the gas can, fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. The wrench is okay as well. We'll, we'll take everything into the house, I think, because... We want to keep it close by. Right. And then there's probably a garbage bag over here. Yes, which is also good. And let ourselves out. There we go. Close that again. And we'll get all this stuff into our house. Now, we are overloaded right now, but it doesn't matter that much. We can stick all of this stuff in here. So, box of nails, box of screws, plank, red nail gun magazine, can all go over here. Um, the garbage bag can go in there for now. Uh, we can actually, uh, let's uh, equip it secondary. That gives us uh, some extra carrying capacity. Uh, the ball peen hammer can go in. The extra screwdriver, the quarter drill, and I think that's about it. We are a little bit peckish now, but we want to lose weight. So we weigh 95 uh, uh, kilos now, and we need to get down to, I think it's 85 to be uh, in optimal health. So we need to do something about our weight. Okay. Well, let's see. There's a guy coming. He's wearing a watch. Come on, go down. A red digital watch. Let's wear that on the left fritz. And we can drop the classic wristwatch. So now we have an, can set an alarm, which is a very good thing. Uh, let's just see our watch. Make sure that there isn't alarms, an alarm set. Uh, there isn't. So we want an alarm at, let's say, 6 o'clock in the morning. Okay. <clears throat> we have a truck here, which wouldn't be a bad thing to get. And this is another two-story home. Okay. I hear, I hear a second zombie, and I don't see it. There it is. Whoa. All right, so your weapons can break. So if you get the opportunity to stop things, then it may be a good idea to take it. Is this door locked? It is. Okay. Well, let's 
jump in through the window and take her out from behind. Okay. Down. Nothing great. Oh, there's a guy over here. There's two guys over here. Alright, you know what? Let's go out this way and deal with them. Right, come on. Oh, they went down. If you stand on a zombie, it can't get up. So that's a very, very useful thing. Okay. Uh, the leather jacket I want. I won't put it on, but I want it. Here, more zombies scraping on windows. Somewhere. Oh. One came in somewhere, or came out. Uh, let's uh, remove these curtains. Where is it? This scares me. No one in there. Well, before we start looting, let's go upstairs and see. No one there. No one there right now. This looks promising, though. No one in here. And no one in here. Okay. Uh, let's uh, remove these curtains. We want them. Uh, we want that sheet. Um, let's put some of this stuff in our plastic bag. The empty bowl can go in there. The empty gas can can go in there. It doesn't give us a lot of carry weight, but it gives us some. And some is better than nothing. Uh, a sewing kit. Okay. Oh, there's a door there. Okay. Sometimes there are bathroom parties that really screw you over. The black digital watch. I'll take that. The house key, I'll take... But we are in the house, so it doesn't really matter that much. Oh, it might have been him that smashed the window. Uh, oh, the bath towel could be okay to get. All right. Now, sometimes there is some sitting around and waiting in this game. If that's the case, I will do that on my own. Pause the recording and... And, um, uh, do things on my own. We can have a lot of stuff in the plastic bag. Okay. Red electric guitar is an okay weapon, actually. We are a little bit overweight now. But all these things, we're going to have to come back to this house. There's stuff that we want. Most definitely. Yeah. We're going to have to come back. So, because we're overweight we're not right now. And overweight makes you tired. Tired makes you slow. Slow makes you dead. Uh, so we don't want to be dead. We'll take this stuff back to our house. Oh, a nice little magazine there. It's nice. And we'll simply set up shop here for now. We'll probably move later if we survive long enough. Um, well, that's already closed. Let's uh, add a sheet to you. And close the curtains. 
we're going to have to move this TV so that we can close that. Let's add a sheet there. And let's add a sheet here. So that the zombies can't see us walking around. Well, it's just here, downstairs at least. Um, don't have any more sheets to add right now. Okay. Well, let's drop some stuff off in here. We'll get a little bit more organized later. For right now, I just want to get rid of some of the stuff. Uh, I mean, the black digital watch is a little bit more manly, but uh, let's uh, use the red one. And we'll put the sewing kit in here. Uh, from the plastic bag, we'll put the metal pack, which is also a decent weapon. Uh, the leather jacket we'll put upstairs. The nails we'll put in there. The hammer we'll put in there. Okay. Uh, the empty bowl, I think we'll stick that in the kitchen. That would make sense, right? Uh, not in the oven. Uh, the premium technologies radio. Um, let's... Uh, is it here, I think? No, it's there. Place that... Uh, Place item. Okay. Where can we put it? There. Let's place that there. And the device options. Yes, it has the automated uh, broadcast thing, so that is great. And we'll tune into that. So this will also give us uh, weather updates which is very, very useful. And it's on 97.8, okay. Well, we don't need to listen to it right now. Um, let's see. I think this will be our bedroom. We'll put our leather jacket in there. We will the bath towel in here and I think that's good we don't really need the wrench on us right now either so we can stick that in our uh, our thing we are uh, anxious right now so we can see these moodles up here so we're hungry and we're anxious uh, anxious because of needing a cigarette we don't have any cigarettes uh, but that's okay for now Let's turn you on because we have six o'clock show. Um, actually, let's. Uh, can I sit on this one? The only things that face this way, I guess. But I don't want to sit on that couch right now. Um, we'll sit here, and then we'll read one of our uh, one of our magazines. Uh, so we're multitasking. Uh, you can speed up time a little bit if you want, but uh, basically it feels like if you do that while you're watching TV, it, it kind of messes with how much experience you get. So right now we are watching some kind of surviving. So, so yeah, we're watching fishing. So we'll be getting some fishing experience. Now, did we already finish our magazine? Uh, already read, yeah. All right, read this then. So you can see we're getting fishing experience here. So uh, that's very nice from watching the TV. And at the same time, we're getting uh, we read The Herbalist and we are reading Electronics Magazine. Uh, so we're getting uh, motion sensor version version one, two, and three. Not bad, not bad. 
We are hungry, so let's eat our carrots. And the TV show is over. We almost got a full XP. And let's uh, turn you off. And that's that. And now we're just peckish again, which is what we want to be. All right. So let's head back over to this house. There's more stuff over here that we want. We can run. We can also sneak. Uh, I want to check out this truck as well. Oh, I hear zombies. Uh, this thing is really in the way. I hear zombies. Well, are you coming? Yeah, you're coming. Ooh, there's one with a helmet on. You want that. And one with a knife in its back. Alright, the motorcycle helmet is the best uh, thing you can get to wear on your head. So, that is wonderful. So we'll grab the leather jacket. And we'll grab that and wear it. Ooh, and bear bloggers. Nice. Iron rolled leather jacket. We'll grab that too. Now we're already reaching the point where we're a little bit heavy. I think we'll check the van and stuff uh, a little bit later. Right now I want to finish checking the upstairs up here. I want to remove the curtains and stuff like that. Uh, so that we can close all of the curtains over in our house. No, no. But close, remove. All right. Red electric guitar. Uh, we can equip that on the back. No, because we attached the... Uh, the... Um, Oh, the Herbalist magazine we already read. So we can actually put that away, and we can put that away. We can grab these two. Um, so we want the VSS, VHSs. Uh, that we don't want. Uh, balaclava. Nah. Cordless phone. I think we can take that apart, maybe, for some electronics experience. Which wouldn't be a bad thing. I will grab the metal sheet. We are going to get very overloaded now. Which is dangerous. I will grab a pillow as well. I think we can make a bed if we have a pillow. That was that there. We've already checked that. Let's go in here and check. We already checked this, I think, yeah. Uh, I already checked this as well, but there is a curtain here. Uh, remove curtains. Don't need a plunger or a toothbrush or anything. That's a pen. We already have that. Uh, I think we're done here. Did I check this? I think I did. Yeah, yeah. All right, so we're done upstairs. So we'll take this stuff back. We're at 23. We're basically twice as heavy as we want to be. Uh, which is tiring us out. Extremely heavy load. It's also doing a little bit of damage to our body. So discomfort. Uh, it's uh, exhausting us. And it's generally not a good thing to be overloaded in this game. It really, really isn't. Uh... Let's get in. Really, I think we need to take this couch apart. Or move the TV. Um, we got a lot of stuff that we want to stick in here, didn't we? Uh, metal sheet. Uh, red electric guitar. Uh... Let's go upstairs, I think. 
Now we can stick the cordless phone in there. And I think that's all I want in here. Um, where do I want to put books and stuff? I think I'll put them upstairs. Um, let's stick them in our uh, nightstand. Magazines and stuff. The TV, the VHSs we obviously need to have downstairs. And we could take the TV upstairs, but no. Let's keep that downstairs. Okay. Jackets. Let's stick there. Okay, we have six sheets, so you're already closed up. You have a sheet, or you have a curtain. We can close that. And what about you? You are already closed. You can add a sheet here. Close that. We already closed that, so now, except for this, we are actually good. Uh, we need to eat again, so let's eat our apple. Uh, VHS, where can I put this? I suppose we could put it in here. Uh, together with the sheets. Uh, the empty gas can I want to keep in case we find some gas. Let's see if we can move this. Um, pick up Value Tech TV. Um, pick up. Can we pick up Brown Load Table? All right, then we're going to. There is the Brown Load Table there. We will place that over here and we'll place the TV there as well. And this means that we now, oh, I need the, I need the sheets. Well, I need one sheet. So let's grab a sheet and close this and that makes me feel wonderfully safe that we have put sheets in front of all our windows that makes them much less breakable not uh, but it is bedtime and that means that i th think that this is a good place to end the episode what i think i will do first though is just wash uh, all clothing and we can speed that up and then we can wash ourselves. There we go. And now it's bedtime. We will close the door for a bit of safety and we can go ahead and sleep. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you are into Project Sunbite. I think it's an absolutely amazing game. And I hope you'll enjoy this uh, playthrough. We'll see how long we survive. Uh, it could be days, it could be weeks, or it could be a few hours. We'll see. So thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.